Hey guys, so today we have a quick video going over this customized hat done by yours truly. So basically what happened was that I was randomly browsing eBay and I ran across some blank hats. Um, in particular, I found this one new with tags, uh, a blank navy blue Vineyard Vines hat for a very good price. I think it was like $10 shipped. For those unfamiliar with Vineyard Vines, it's a preppier brand and I can pair their hats to something like a Polo Ralph Lauren um, hat like this one. Anyways, I wasn't too sure what to do with this blank hat, as it was rather bland to wear, um, in my opinion. So, I was browsing YouTube, and from what I've seen, a lot of people put patches on their gear. So, what I did was I located a patch that goes with a navy blue colored theme. I found this throwback Nets iron-on patch on eBay for really cheap, so I decided to grab it. Um, I'd recommend sewing the patch on for security, um, however, if you don't know how to sew, quick tip is to use fabric glue to adhere the patch to that. I tried the iron-on deal thing with the patch since um, it's an iron-on, um, but since the hat flexes to the shape of your head, the glue on the iron-on patch that it comes initially with isn't too strong. Um, but to be, care be careful with the fabric glue because um, it could get messy and will leave a lot of residue if you aren't careful and uh, don't overapply. So as you can see, this turned out decently well. Uh, I could have been more careful with the glue as well as place to uh, patch itself a little lower, but it's pretty good for what it is. Uh, if you guys could come up on a blank hat or even a cheap one, um, wherever, like a thrift store or something, you could turn a simple hat into something you really like. So yeah, thanks for watching and uh, stay tuned for more videos. Peace out, guys.